Bum, bada, bum, bum, bum. Let me check and see if we're streaming. It looks like we are. Looks like we might just be. We're going to edit this video now. We're going to start editing this video now. It's called Live Stream Editing for Andy Rayfeld. And let me da 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 da. Find him. Bear with me now. We're going to begin. We're going to begin. Let me find the link to this. Sorry, I'm looking up because I have this other monitor up top. So anyway, long story short is I, I came across this video that was kind of, I don't know if it's funny or not. I thought it was funny. And um, it was Pastor David Manning. And, uh, gee, it was called, like, Fire in the Butthole or something like that. But anyway, I sent it to my friend Andy. I told him he needs to make a song out of it. And so he did. And so now I have the video footage. So I'm going to open up Premiere CS6, the old-fashioned. And I have a, a session I started here called Burning Butthole, James David Manning Metal Remix. So I already created that session, and so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go to my folder for music and Andy and the song, and then I'm going to pull in one of his main clips that is a HD clip, and it's going to say... Clip is not matched, sequence settings, change to match the clip. And in this case, I'm going to do this. I usually don't do this, but I'm going, oh, I didn't do it actually, but keep sequence settings. But anyway, it fits, it's 1080, that's fine. I was wrong, nice expression, Andy. All right, so anyway, I'm just gonna keep it at this, um, whatever you call it, sequence settings. I'm just gonna pull in all this stuff right here. I'm going to grab it and drag it all right here. Ah, hold on a second. Let me do that with a clean, let me do that from like a clean slate again. Let me delete all that. Then I'll just grab everything at once. Right, it's saying, do you want to change it? I'm going to keep it, keep my settings because they're 1080. And so here we go. Let the fun begin. I'm going to open up a track. And hold on a second, let me just... Look at my, oh, see, there I am. There we are. Looking good, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this audio track and throw it down here. I'm going to expand these. I expand these little audio clips, whoops, and drag them out so I could see the wave somewhat. And I'm going to put this over here, and that's going to be the length of our edit. So how are we going to do this? If I click in this space here and I click delete, it shuffles everything over. So let's say I have stuff like spread out and I want to, you know, bring them all together. I just click in this area and click the delete key and it puts them all together. Ah, a little shortcut. Didn't know that, did you? I bet you didn't know that. Now you do. Okay, so what I need to do is put this in time. So I don't know what I'm working with here. And actually, let me take a look at this and make sure his clips, they are 1080. So if I, yep, they are. Control Z to undo. I just scaled it just so I could see if it fit perfectly the frame, which it does. And so that's all good. This clip is not 1080. So I'm gonna have to go to the motion and scale that up to about there-ish. Actually, I might just wanna like scale it all the way up and then probably wanna like slide it up to cut off that text. And I know I'm cutting some of the frame out, but for now, let's just do that. Uh, this music, I'm going to take this music off. That's some other song, so I'm going to hold Alt, click on this, and delete that music. I'm going to throw this over here for now. This right here is the Manning clip. This is where we got the vocals from, so it's very small. I'm going to crank it up in the scale under motion, and I'm going to make that fit right there, and it'll just have some black bars on the side. That's just the way it goes for now. And... See, I don't know if we could find better quality than that. 
So I'm going to actually go look this up really quick. Right, I'm going to pull open a window and just go to one of my channels for the moment. And I'm going to search for Manning Butthole. I'm going to close this because we're done with this folder. Um, all right, so what do we got here? We have it right here Manning in the Butthole Flames of Homosexuals. All right. So let me look at the quality of this. Oh, it's definitely, looks like definitely better quality than what I'm looking at here. So, somehow that file got crunched. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up this, which is called 4K Video Downloader. It's a free program for downloading videos. If you search, I'll show you right here. If you search 4K video downloader, it's a free program you can get right here. Download the program and once you got it, click on it, it opens right up. And what you want to do is go to smart mode and make sure you're set at um, video MP4 quality best quality and then select where you want it to save to like in this case I'll save it actually just to like keep my files together I'll save it back in that folder where everything else is or you know what for now I'm just gonna save it I have everything sent to this like one main folder here and I'll just send it there and what I do is I copy this URL and I open that back up and I paste the URL there and just literally in a matter of seconds this file is going to come downloading through at the highest possible resolution which is 1080 in this case so that's good so in this case let me just send that down and I'm going to right click this and go to show in folder and there's the video I'm going to cut it and I'm going to go move it to that folder where everything else is and then I'm gonna drag it in here and all of a sudden it's boom it's big so there we didn't compromise quality like if you go look between that one and this one it's like a whole different story see this like tiny file and if I were to drag it back out it looks all blurry and gross right I'll show you that full screen so you can see whoops see that but then over here it's like BAM night and day right so I'm gonna get rid of the old one and I'm gonna keep the new and then this what's gonna be tricky is in order to line this up I gotta find the words of the song so let's give a listen to the song let's see what we got here of Andy playing instruments alright so the good thing is it looks like he just played the song straight to it so I should be able to come over here and find the uh, transients of some of this stuff. So for the moment, I'm just going to drag this out big. Right. And I'm going to close this window because we're done with that. So... Let's see if anybody's even watching at the moment. I doubt anybody's watching because I don't have that many subscribers on this channel. It says one watching. All right, then. Uh, bear with me here. I'm just checking on this with my own stream here. And I'll actually... I'm actually going to go post it. Post my stream... So maybe I can get viewers to come and watch. Right? Is that a smart move? Let me just share it with people right quick. I go share it on some pages. See if we can get a little audience here. All right. Let's 
it for now. I'm going to move along. I don't want to uh, keep you guys waiting because I know you want to see what's going on here for sure. Where's my dashboard? There's my dashboard. Let me shrink it down in case anybody does comment. I'll be able to see. All right, so we're going to move along. Sorry, I'm looking up. My other monitor is like above here. All right, so now we're going to try to match up the audio with the video. The way I see it is I'm going to look for the ending. His audio file here, his audio wave looks small, but right already it kind of looks like it's matched up. You can already see that it's somewhat matched. So if I were to play this through, Now I'm going to put on the music. Alright, so we got our bass track lined up. That was easy. All right, so let's go ahead and move on over with this. What's this? Piano. Not the best angle, but let me check and make sure. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Oh, what is this? Drums. I think this is drums. All right, sorry. I had the sound off. <laughs> That's funny. That works. Okay, let me match this up. I'm going to have to take this, and I'm just going to go right over the audio for that other track because we're not going to use that audio. I'm going to layer it on top and try to go ahead and sync up this audio. And I'll look at it once again. This audio here can be... Spark. Oh, I'm going to leave it. Be Spark. I'll leave that for now. And I'll line up this, which looks like it needs to come right about here-ish, right? See what he says here. Drums take two. Maybe half of the song. <laughs> the song is ridiculous. <laughs> this is all my fault. Okay, so. <laughs> Alright, so we got drums lined up, we got bass lined up, layered. What else we got here? A piano or a guitar? Oh, this is the piano intro here. So let's throw that in there. <laughs> nice fedora. All right, so that should work easy. I'm just gonna throw this right in the front here. And to me, it looks like it's going to line up. Actually, we're going to have to move the whole song over. So what I'm going to do is grab this, copy it, and I'm going to go to the beginning and hit insert, and it's going to shift everything over, and I could delete that. So I just bought myself some room here. So I'm going to slide this over. Let me hear where it comes in. All right, that's the beginning. So I'm guessing this is the beginning. This opening hit. Since that's the beginning, I can click here and hit delete and drag everything back over. All right, so I'm just going to pull this down as the as the intro. I'm going to cut all this. I'm going to cut all this off too. I'm just going to start it right up with like boom right there. We're not going to like waste any time. So I'm going to cut this, cut that. 
come down here and grab um, a fade and throw it in there and then I'm going to hit del delete in there and shift everything so right off the bat we're going to start off like this. Alright, hold on a second. Okay, I'm going to post this on my channel or my page. Just be like, watch me edit live. I'm editing live now. If you're bored, come tell me in the comments of the live stream how bad my editing is. All right, Let's see if we get some visitors from that. All right, moving along, moving right along. Only one person watching. I am not famous. All right, so. God's gonna put a kiss in the bottle. All right, I'm gonna cut that off. I'm gonna delete this audio. You know what, actually I'm going to take this audio from here and bring it up as the main audio. We don't need any of that other audio. So we're actually making quite a bit of progress really fast. So I'm going to pull this over, pull this over, and now I'm going to grab this one. And I'll put it up here, bring it down here. Probably easy to, what? Let me see what he's wasted some time in the beginning. I'll just start it right there from the beginning of the piano and I'll pull this up to the top down to the bottom drag it over piano starts right there just about maybe just a little sooner like there ish Delete this. Um, here, let me bring this. Never mind. We're going to leave it as is. Actually, you know what? That volume is really loud. I'm going to bring this down. I'm going to make sure I don't have any filters on here. No, there's no filters on there. Okay. All right, so we're set with layers here. He's always got to wear that shirt, too. All right. So now we got to get Pastor Manning up in here. Like edit this with a straight face. <laughs> I can't edit this. All 
All right, so just cut off the ending there. Now it's time to add in this. Now this is going to be the hardest part, actually, because now I'm going to have to find all the words that match up. I got a word of knowledge, a word of prophecy, and I want you preachers to use this word of prophecy ever, whenever you go. That God is going to put a bird. God is going to put a cat. That God. <laughs> all right, so. This is going to be the tricky part, really. It's going to be probably tedious. God. I'm going to have to change. I'm going to have to change the timing of the words here. Oh, the cancer, he says. Hold on. Oh, look, it lines up pretty good. <laughs> oh, I can't stop. All right. Why am I doing this? All right, so we got the first opening line. Got that part. This is working out fairly well. I'm going to hold Alt and drag this over, copy it. Pull this over. Oh boy. Sorry, I'm just going to edit fast. Just going to start editing fast. find that part it's gonna get tedious Well, it's good that he didn't really change the timing of it very much. That's it right there. We'll get cancer in the bottle. We'll get cancer in the bottle. Stop. 
Uh, okay, I don't think that's in there. take a break. I'm going to go get some brownies or something. Get some water. See if anybody joined in. No. One person watching. Who's watching? Does it count myself? I'm shut that off. Is anybody watching? If anybody's watching, say something, type something in the stream. All right, I'm going to be right back. I'm going to be right back. I'm going to get some ice. I'm going to let this play. Whoops, I had it muted. Ah, whoops. I'm gonna let this play till I come back. Wages of sin is death. What are you now standing there letting people get by with sin? It's death. Get, get up. up. 
All right, we're back. We're back. Where did we leave off? There's the chorus. Can't sit it down. He can't sit it down. Uh, that's the chorus right there. He can't sit it down. He's can't sit it down. Sorry, I don't really want to talk much while I'm editing because I just want to edit it fast. Oh, God. 
Well, it's all right in order, so that definitely makes it easier. And he hasn't really changed the timing of it. So all the lyrics are somewhat falling into place. a little off. Let me hear the original. This one lines up. So we'll slow this down just a little bit, so maybe like 90. Works perfectly, actually. Slow that one down. When God gets through with the summer, this is the word of the Lord. This is the prophecy of Almighty God. This is the Lord's word. This is the Lord's word. And Pastor, if you are Sodomite, God will have a plane coming out of your bottle. Oh, Sodomite. I think this is the next line. Pretty sure that was the next line. That's the next line. <laughs> That's the next line. Seeing nothing yet. You ain't seen nothing yet.
to the chorus. son of Satan, the son of a sack of white trash. You heard me eight years ago and you ignored me. Well, you ignore me now, God will destroy you. You, you think, think that. that. You, you think, think what, what them people, people can, can do, do to you. You, you think, think what, what them members, members can do to you by talking, talking about, about you on the phone. phone. You, you think, think what, what them members can do to you by not giving money, money to support the church. The church. Well, you, well, you ain't seen nothing, my friend, until you have a flame coming out of your butthole and you need a bestest diaper to be able, able to, to keep, keep that flame from burning a hole in your pants. pants. You, you ain't seen nothing, nothing yet. yet. And there'll, there'll be people, people walking around all over America, America with flames, flames coming out, out of their bones. <laughs> every Sunday, every Sunday, every everyone, everyone who takes it up the rear, rear. everyone who takes it, everyone who has uh, a penis injected in his butthole will have a flame. When that penis comes out, the flame will start burning. And there'll, there'll be, be no, no more sodomy, because ain't, ain't nobody, nobody gonna stick no penis in that flame. flame. You ain't gonna stick a penis in that flame. flame. That flame will be an eternal flame coming out of the butthole of every sodomite. Of every sodomite, there'll be a flame coming out of the butthole, and you'll need an investor's diaper. It will stop there. How many times are you gonna say the same thing? You do what you think. You fall down on your knees, down on your knees. And ask, ask Jesus to come into your life. life. Ask, ask Jesus to heal and deliver you. That, that you will not have a flame coming, flame coming out of your, your butt. butt. At least he believes that, that um, homosexuals can be saved. Now. Oh my goodness, I, I can't find the parts. I guess it's like later on. I gotta listen to this. You will not be able to get in the bathtub and put it out. You will not be able to get in the toilet 
and, 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 and put, put it, it out. You will not be able to wash it out. You'll need an asbestos diaper in order to be able to stop that flame. And nobody will ever stick a penis in your butthole again because it will be on fire. It will be flames of fire. You think AIDS was bad. You ain't seen nothing till you see the flame coming out of T.D. Jake's butt. The worst. Jesus into your church. Number two, preach against the sodomite maker. The rock will say no bomb of Satan, Satan, and his compadre is crying and unnatural you. Burgundy, I'm the Lord. Either you preach God's word, God will visit the uh, destruction upon you, like uh, on you and your family, like you have never ever seen before. Now, what's it going to be? What's it going to be? What's it going to be? I'm the Lord. I'm the Lord. I'm the Lord. I'm the Lord. One day it won't be long. On Harlem night, all the faggots up in Harlem that I pronounce the flame. You're going to think you're going to be in the midst of the swamps of South Carolina and what they call the lightning bug. I don't know if you've ever seen a lightning bug, but he flies around with a flame, but light coming out of his behind. And everywhere you look, they light up the swamps. They light up the woods. They light up the rural areas of North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, Mississippi, Alabama. They light it all up down in New Orleans. The lightning bug got a flame coming out of his butt. The lightning bug. Well, it won't be too many days now when Almighty God wishes to exalt the preaching that I've done to James David Manning that you're going to see on a Saturday night. All of a sudden, Harlem's going to be lit up with flames coming out of the butt of these faggots. Flames coming out, fire, flames shooting out of the behind. You're going to see it's going to be a wonder to behold. You're going to see the power of God fall upon Harlem. All right, that part was there. That part was in the song. Power of God. Behold, you're going to see the power. I heard that part in the song.
Better save this. <clears throat> so we got most of it. I just can't find that other, this middle section. I wonder if it's at the end. Let me find the what he's saying. missing part of it.
All right, I gotta go find these parts that I'm missing. I'm gonna actually <clears throat> delete this. Whoops, and pull in. the whole thing again. I'm going to have to listen from the top and try to find those parts. find these parts There's part of it. Looks like that's part of it. I think he pieced together things here. Until you have a 
spring money to support it can do it even by top five will destroy you. Everyone who has a, a penis in pocket, there'll be no more sodomy. You can go stick a penis of every sodomy. Oh, here we go. Of every sodomy. Turn the plane out of the butthole of every sodomy. That's the, the line. There we go. That's the part. slow.
I can't find this part. I think that's it right there. Pretty sure he said something like that. Whoops. Lightning bug. That's what he used right there. Pretty sure that was the line. Yep. Okay. 
You ignore me now, God will fix you. Now, you can do one of two things. Right there. Missing just a few little parts here. Want to see what we got so far? Well, we're close. Missing a few parts, and then we gotta slip in like the other instruments. I hear this crackling noise right here when the first lyric, when the first beat comes in.
Well, it's like halfway there now. You guys want to see it from the top? Oh, I'm missing part of the the words here. Oh, he's saying it. Cool, we can use that. Yes, that's perfect. Perfect. Nice.
Oh, there you go.
What do you guys think? Is it a hit? I still got to insert um, footage of the, uh, the the church buck dancing. I saw two parts I think I need to fix. Yeah. 
I think I should cut off the black bars on this footage, on this right here. What do you think? How about... that? I just don't like the black bars. Yeah. 
him now. The flesh of God will destroy you. Hallelujah. And amen. And amen. And amen. 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 The sodomites destroy God's word. Destroy the sodomites. God will destroy you. Hallelujah. Oh, before Almighty God, the Lord has sent the word. God has sent the word. Ye shall be justly afflicted. Oh, bless the Lord, oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Preach the word. Preach God's word. Better get up and Lord. Best of pants to stop that money. I'm the Lord. I said, I'm the Lord. I'm James David Madden. Preachers, you better get up and preach. Mothers and fathers, you better get up. I said, I'm the Lord. I'm James David Madden. I'm the Lord. I said, I'm the Lord. I'm James David Madden. Hallelujah. And amen. amen. And amen. amen. And amen. amen. put this.
I'm changed. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. And amen. And amen. amen. amen.
An enemy. enemy.
pretty much it I'd say uh, last thing is I'll throw a da, 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 da. 
uh, an adjustment layer. Over the top. Majority of it's done. How long did that take for the whole video? Three hours, three hours and 12 minutes. So I'll put an adjustment layer over the top. And I'll put on the unsharp mask and the fast color corrector. The unsharp mask. I'll put this on, let's say, three and crank it up to maybe 80. So that's, that's not doing a whole lot, but a little bit. Let's make it a little sharper. And then for the fast color corrector, I'm going to bring up the mids like 1.1 to give it a little more boost, a little boost of brightness. And I'll put up the saturation, maybe like 120. So this is without, and this is with. That's without, that's with. So that's without, that's with. It's up probably a little too saturated. So I'm going to bring the saturation to maybe like 112. And maybe bring crunch the blacks a little bit to like 3 or 6. So that's without. I mean that's with. This is without. With. Without. That's without. That's with. So it's just a minor uh, boost in a little bit of the color clarity. Nothing major. Add another unsharp mask. I'm going to copy and paste it and then I'm going to change this to like, I don't know, six and maybe like 50 ish. Maybe bring this down to two. And so now this is without, that's with, without, with. So you can see the eyes and the problem is I don't want it to become too grainy looking. It's like adding a little grain in there. So is it that one that's adding the grain? I think so. They're both adding a little bit of grain, so maybe bring them down to like 50. Maybe put this one at like 10. And drop it down to like 25 amount. It's adding like a little bit of grain, but i to find that middle point. I'm going to bring this radius. What if I bring it way down? Oh, see, that looks actually interesting. Raised up. So I put that at like 30. It's a little too much, but... I 
that gives some clarity and then this one drop it back to like three Eh, I'm going to bring it down to like 0.1. See what happens if I crank it all the way up. See all the green? So maybe put it at like 100. Let's put it at, oh, that's 1.1 radius. Gotta be careful with this. Point one. So I'm gonna put it on like point five. Put it at one hundred. not doing a lot visibly so I'm gonna put it on two two and like 25 I think that's it 2.5 so let's say this is off, this is on. It's like a minor difference, nothing major. I don't want to overkill it. That's on, it's off, on, off. It definitely has more like defined edges with it on. Definitely sharper looking. I think like this I think for for I think for this where he's like stretched out on this one, I feel like making it black and white. feeling that if I watch it through again it's gonna lag because of the what do you call it the adjustment layer Oh, you had. Sorry, just checking mail. Let's try to watch it through. It's probably going to lag because of the adjustment layer, though.
That's pretty much it. Um, put some like final touches at the end or whatever for the outro, but I think that's pretty much it. So it was about like three and a half hours, you know, with a couple little breaks and just taking it easy. Um, yep. So pretty much wraps it up for the most part. Might make some minor changes after the fact, but. The work is pretty much done. The video is practically finished. Um, at the end here, I don't know if he should go right into talking because it should probably have like a pause. I don't know. We'll figure out the ending after. We're going to put a plug at the end anyway. We might not even have this part. I don't know about the ending yet, but... Something like that, but well, whatever. We'll figure that out. We'll leave that up to you, Andy, however you want to end it. I don't know if you're going to send me a plug to put at the end or what. Um, I don't know. The other thing I notice is right here when it comes in. On the word cancer, I hear this like crackling, breaking up noise in the, in the voice, in the audio, right on the first cancer. But that could just, I don't know what that is. Could be. I just hear a popping. It could be in the his recording. It could be in his actual recording. Like there might not be anything you could do about that. All right, I'm gonna wrap this up and end this. And um, the final step here would be to um, export it. I mean, this, this might not be the final export because, like I said, we're going to put a plug at the end or whatever we're going to put on it. But just to have an export that's playable, I'm going to go to H.264 for the format. I'm going to pick a preset that I have. So the file will be like half a gig at this preset, pretty much. 580 megabytes, which is really small. And that's it, Metal Remix. So just put like edit one. And we'll just send it out. Queue it up. And export it. 
Shouldn't really take that long. Oh, it says it's going to be done in eight minutes. It's dropping down to six minutes. Five. That's pretty quick, actually. Who is watching? Say something. Type something. Anyway, I'm going to let that export. Once it's exported, it should play back. Well, it's going to play back smooth in the video player. That's where you really get like a you know a fair viewing of it. But not bad. What is? How long is the song? Like three and a half minutes. So if the song is about oh, the song's only two and a half minutes. Well, that's good. I was going to say it kind of equaled up three and a half minutes to three and a half hours of editing, but it's actually only two and a half minutes song. But that's not bad. Putting all this footage together and syncing it all up in three and a half hours is really not that bad. Putting effects on it, chopping it all up like tediously where every part fits, having the, the zooming in effects and things like that going on. And all, everything all synced up, everything having its part. Not that bad at all for like an entire edit. We kind of banged that one out pretty quick there, I'd say. I'm going to go get a snack and let this render, but it's pretty much done. I don't know who's watching. I don't know if that's Andy was watching or some stranger I don't know nobody's typed anything it says it says at least one it says two people are watching all right well type something in the chat tell me who's watching all right I'm gonna go get a snack and let this render
All right, I'm going to uh, take off this and that, and we'll give it one watch through here. Give it one run through here. Let me check the volume. Bring up the volume. All right, let's give it one fair watch through. We'll find some mistake I made. God's gonna put a I'm the Lord's servant. I'm James David Manning. Hallelujah. And amen. And amen. And amen. Well, there you have it. There you have it. That's all, folks. That's all. Whoever is watching, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Nobody typed anything or said anything, so maybe you're just a bot. But anyway, we're done for now. And uh, make sure you go to hitwavemusic.com and um, that's it. May your life be as awesome as you pretend it is on Facebook. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff. See ya. See ya. Happy quarantine, people. Happy quarantine. Stop stream here. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it here so you can see. You can see how I press the button. Stop stream. Goodbye.